Hello guys and welcome to my channel. Today we will explore three of the most beautiful castles in Bavaria, Germany. Without further ado, let's jump right into the video and drive to Prien am Chiemsee. There we will take a boat because our first castle, Schloss Herren Chiemsee, is located on an island one hour away from Munich. The ticket price varies depending on how many islands you want to see. Getting to two islands and back costs about 10 euros per person. Have a stroll around the gardens and the castle or just sit there and enjoy the sun. If you come late, you have to pay attention to not miss the last boat. But if you still have time, you might want to visit the Fraueninsel, the neighboring island, with its monastery as well. Do you want to dance? This trip is perfect for you if you want to combine traditional architecture with lots of nature and a boat cruise. Castle number 2 – Neuschwanstein The world famous castle is a one and a half hour drive from Munich by car. Once you get to Hohenschwangau, you can either hike up the mountain or wait for the next bus. In the meantime, let's explore the village. Everything to the sunrise And every time I'm alone I'll call your name Been three years still long for you These restless times that I've been through I look to the sky and I call you Can you hear me? The moonlight shadows from my broken home But I call you Cause you're my shining star Okay, time to get onto the bus. The round trip is 3 euros per adult and 1 euro 50 per child. To get the best view of Neuschwanstein Castle, you need to cross the Marienbrücke. I hope you're not afraid of heights because this could get very tricky then. A little hike gives you even another angle on the castle. There is tours inside of the castle, however, you have to reserve online very early. Unfortunately, due to Corona, 
the maximum capacity of visitors allowed is very limited. If you're looking for the German castle experience, then Neuschwanstein is the right one for you. Number 3. Nymphenburg Palace Nymphenburg Palace is more or less in the city center of Munich, so easily accessible with all kinds of public transportation. The castle grounds themselves are free of charge and perfect for a nice long stroll in the park. You will definitely meet some of the locals there. Depending on the lockdown situation, you can also visit the inside of the palace. The regular entry fee is 8 euros, but you can additionally get an audio guide available in 8 languages. Grab your ticket, because the beautiful ceiling frescoes are not to be missed. A little background information. The palace was built in the 18th century as summer residency to kings and emperors of the Wittelsbach family. It is one of the biggest residencies in Europe, even bigger than Versailles Castle in France. Besides the main rooms that we are visiting today, there is also a porcelain museum as well as rooms to rent for festivities. On your way out of the palace, you will pass the shop, so if you haven't gotten your souvenirs yet, you might want to have a look. Let's check out the little park palaces. There is actually four of them, but I chose to go to two very different ones. By the way, I recommend to not bring any fancy shoes, because the ground is just gravel here. Let me know your favorite castle down below in the comments. As always, thank you for watching and if you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Stay healthy, stay safe and see you in the next one. Bye!